hello everybody and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Brotherhood in the last episode. We started on the quest of making some friends and unfortunately that meant that the um, the head of the Rosa, I guess that's what we're gonna call it, died. And now we have to go tell them that their, that their leader died. Uh, however, I, as I know this mission is going to be going, we're, um, we're going to be enlisting someone else to be the leader of the, the Rosa. A, uh, a certain friend of ours, if, you, if I do say so myself. Probably not a friend, more of a... Ow! That was my shoulder. Ow! That was also my shoulder. Could you please stop? Wow, he didn't die for me. There we go. <laughs> Yeah. Luckily, I have not, uh, I have not fallen in the water yet, so I almost did screw it up right, right as I was beginning this episode, or uh, right as I started recording, um, I almost, I almost fucked it up, but, um, luckily I did not, so I'm, uh, I am very, very glad that I did not screw up the 100% sink, because we're not, for those of you who didn't watch the last episode, we're not supposed to swim. And I tried to jump across water to a platform, which I accidentally, uh, I almost accidentally dunked myself in. So, that would have been bad. I am trying to get 100% sync on this, on this game, on this save file. Uh, or, or, or as close as I can, because there are missions in the game that as you get better sync, you unlock them. So, that's one of the things. Oh, good God. Oof. Um, I'm starting to wonder. <laughs> uh, yeah, there we go. I'm starting to wonder if we, if I should cut to the Rosa, cut to where I get to the Rosa. But I feel like it's just, like just right, right on the corner. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. See you, sir. Oh, there it is. Okay. That works. That works entirely. Oh, it's in the back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Me, the man who said I know who uh, I know how the I know how this mission is going to go. It doesn't know where to continue the mission. Brilliant. Mother, sister. Ezio, Sir Machiavelli said that you might be here. What are you doing in Roma? Has Firenze been attacked? No, or rather, I do not know. We did not go to Firenze. Why? Ezio, we want to help. I was trying to help you by sending you to Firenze. Where is Madonna Solari? She's dead. Merda. What now? Will we have to close? You cannot close. I need your help. Messere, without someone who can run things, we're finished. I'll do it. You do not belong here, Claudia. I know how to run a business. I ran Uncle Mario's for years. This is different. What alternative do you have, Ezio? You do this, Claudia. And you are on your own. I've been on my own for 20 years. What? what? Fine. I intend to repair the brothel. This place is a real mess. And I want your courtesans to find Katarina Sforza. You can count on us. And it's going to be free for some reason. Yeah, I... Oh, it, it's not free. Oh. It's not free. I thought it was free, but evidently it is not. Technically it is free because all I did was steal money off of people, but yeah. <laughs> Ooh, we're stuck in NAS now. Such a mess. Real mess. Can I? Oh. It went into a cutscene. Well, darn. Why did the music come Welcome to the Rosa in Fiore. As you can see, the most popular brothel in Roma. My money went well invested. Here, I keep a list of the skills taught to my girls. You're not teaching them much. Think you could do better? Nessun problema. Ezio, 
The Borgia make it difficult for Claudia's girls. There are several things you could do that would aid them. I will keep that in mind. Anything else? No. Ezio... Did you find Caterina? We are working on it. Bene. Come to see me at Isola Tiberina with her location. Damn, those quotes are swagalicious. And I just used the word swagalicious. <laughs> Can, can someone please slap me through the internet? Thank you. <laughs> okay. Um, now there's a couple missions that we could do while we're here. Well, not necessarily while we're here. We, we, we could take on while we're here. Uh, speak. Speaky spoo. Buongiorno, mother. Ezio, thank you for coming to see me. What troubles the courtesans? The old proprietor of this brothel, Madonna Solari, was a cheat and liar. Her ties to the church have been uncovered. Worse, several of those who work for us sleep with the enemy still. I will find them. Visit the girls I trust. They will help you. Grazie, Ezio. Okay. Right. Excuse me, sir. Can I leave, please? There we go. I was trying to press A for some reason. I don't know how to play game. Um, where are these girls that you speak of? Ah, oh, fuck off. Nope, nope, you're not getting me. You're not getting me. No. Thank you. There we go, there's one. Okay, let me, let me show you guys something. The heart icon. That one right there. It's called a Christina mission. We will get those as we get higher in sync. Um... Not the, not the band. In, in, in the game. No! Stop! Stop showing that! I, I'm going to get copyright! Stop it! Okay. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> but as we, as we get more missions and as we do them 100% uh, sync more and more, we'll increase our overall sync and get more Christina missions. So that's kind of the, kind of the long and the short of it. I still kind of want to do like 100% run of this game. Uh, I know I'm, I don't want to do uh, like I did in Assassin's Creed 2, you know, doing all the feathers and all that crap, which was exhausting. Uh, I don't think I'd, in this case, I don't think I'd want to do um, the flags. I'm pretty sure there's still feathers in this game, but I'm pretty sure I want, want to do the flags. But uh, I do want to do kind of a 100% run, uh, do all the stuff that actually matters, you know. Uh, actually matters to the story. Anyway, um, so yeah, we'll be doing those at a later point. Right now, however, we want to go over here to the memory. And and since I usually, um, since I usually uh, cut out the running and the jumping and the traversing across the city, especially for long uh, tra travels, I'm not sure what, what the word is there, but especially for long, um, long free runs and stuff like that, uh, I will be duh! I will be duh! Anyway, I, I will be doing that here, so I will skip over to the memory start, and I will see you guys in just a minute. Well, here we are. This sh I was about to say, this, sh this should look familiar, but no, that's a, not the same thing. Ezio Auditore! Bartolomeo! Come in, come in! I'll kill you if you don't. <laughs> Bartolomeo. Wait here. You have to meet my wife. Fantasilea! Fantasilea! Where is she? Did you check behind the table? <laughs> ah, here she is. Lieta di conoscervi. Charmed. Truly. Now, we talk about war. How goes the fight against the French? Bene. My men are holding their own. Machiavelli seemed to think things were more difficult. You know Machiavelli... Abbiamo bisogno del vostro aiuto! Scusatemi. Throw me Bianca. Ezio, let me get straight to the point. The fight is not going well. We have been attacked on both sides. Borgia on one, French on the other. But know this, the Borgia position is weak. If you can defeat them, we can concentrate our forces on the French front. I think I know a way to help. 
Thank you for disclosing this to me, Madonna Dalviano. It is the least a wife can do to help her husband. Lovely. Between a rock and a hard place. A <coughs> uh, excuse me. <coughs> no, I should have got some water. Eliminate the Borgia captain, sending his troops to attack the barracks so the, mer so the mercenaries can focus entirely on the French assault. Full synchronization, kill only the Borgia captain. Can do. Someone! Stop their leader before he gets to the tower! Oh, 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 Shania Twain. Ah, uh, not you, not you, not you, thank you. Hey! You, little bastard, get back here! Get back here, you asshole. What's up, bitch? BAM! What? What? I just got past you! <laughs> you fucker. <laughs> okay. Go, please. Oh my god. How is it how is it so hard to kill you? Thank you. Nope. I am not messing with you, sir. I I am not supposed to kill anyone except the captain. Oh my god. This is not the way I wanted to go. This is not this is not it. No. Okay. I'm just going this way then. Whee! Shite. Jump down, jump down, jump down. <laughs> oh lord. Woo! Okay, so... Yeah, I gotta do this. Now this time, I can swim. Oh my god. Just freaking dive, thank you. Yay! Swim dive! Dan Dan. Okay. Can I? There we go. Let's say, can I not get up now? Did I? Did I do a screw job? Screw job? I feel like that's a, a euphemism that I don't want. <laughs> what I meant to say was, did I screw it up? But <laughs> you know how these things go. <laughs> oh Lord. Okay. <laughs> I'm still mad that I can't do a climb leap. For some reason, despite um, despite it being possible in Assassin's Creed 2, without the climb leap glove, which is, is which is a new item in Brotherhood, um, you can't do it without the climb leap glove in Brotherhood. Don't know why, but but you can also do it without the climb leap climb leap glove. In Revelations, the next game in the series. So, it kind of pisses me off, but <laughs> I don't know. It's just weird. Set shit on fire! Now, getting back up to Bartolomeo will be a little bit more tricky, unfortunately. Yes, I know. I know how this thing works, thank you. I'm wanting to say, yeah, there's a little... I, 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 don't, <coughs> I don't know what to call it, but, um... Zipline? Kind of? Kind of a zipline? Yes. There we go. <coughs> Yeah, like I said, it's not it's not very clear, clear cut where we're supposed to be going. Well, I know where we're, where we're supposed to be going, but I don't know how, to, how exactly to get there. Like, I feel like it's simpler than than what I'm trying to make it out to be. Don't think I can climb up there. No. Ah, crap. There we go. Yeah, there you go. Okay, good. 
Now, we just gotta make it all the way over back there. Because, of course we do. Gotta make it super difficult to get to what we get from one place to another. There you go. There you go. There you go. Get some money while we're at it. Just a little bit of money. Alright, what now? Ezio! We sent those Luri di Codardi running for the hills! Yes, we did. Now that the Pope's dogs have fled, I will be able to draw more men to the fight. But first I want to reinforce our barracks. Who will take care of this? I'm no good with these things. You are the educated one. You approve the plans. Va bene. But in return, I need to know Cesare and Rodrigo's every move. Can your men keep track of them for me? Of course. Educated? I mean, I don't know, like, the education system of, you know, Renaissance Italy, but... I'd say I was, like, 16 or 17 when, when Assassin's Creed 2 happened, so... I don't know about educated. Of course, he could have gotten some education from the Assassins, but... We don't really see any of that, so... I don't know. Maybe that's, maybe that's how he spent the, you know, 10 to 12 years of Assassin's Creed 2. Anyway. Um, renovating Bartolomeo's barracks will allow the mercenaries to have a more prominent presence in Rome, aiding in the fight against the Borgia. Hell yeah, upgrade! Beautiful. Guaranteed for life. Guaranteed for life? Dang. It's one hell of a guarantee. Isn't she a thing of beauty? Indeed. Very impressive. More men join us every day. It has become very competitive, which is just the way I like it. As you can see, this board shows the ranks of our top warriors. Prove your skills, and you will move up the list. <laughs> Shouldn't I already be at the top? Chance fighting downstairs! If you're looking to show off, we also have fights. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got money on this match. <laughs> now, of course you do. Where is Bartolomeo? At the fight downstairs. He has such an aggressive view of the world. However, strategy is equally important. Take these carrier pigeons, for example. Each one sent from Machiavelli bears the name of an important Templar in Roma. Eliminate them, and you will have more of an impact than a battle ever could. Thank you, Madonna. Can you ask Bartolomeo to come see me at Isola Tiberina with a report about Cesare and Rodrigo's whereabouts? He will be there. And now we learn about yet another way to, to make money, as well as a way to earn even more friends. This right here is a pigeon coop, as you can probably tell. But that's not what I'm going to do. Uh, can I not do the thing? Okay, I don't know why this isn't working. To receive a test. Oh. That's because we don't have any people to send on assassin contracts. Yeah, that's right. Okay. So, we will be getting uh, assassin recruits here in the in the near future, in the next couple episodes. And we will be able to send them on missions uh, using the pigeon coops. So that's, a, that's an explanation of what that is. However, before we leave, we have one last mission. Oh, that's not the button I meant to hit. We have one last mission to start. It's all the way down here. So, once again, I'll see you guys in just a minute. Here we are. Finally. Pr pretty much got lost in Rome. Wow. Probably, not, probably not the only person Stay. to get lost in Rome, though. <laughs> Big city. Big city. Alright. <laughs> Ezio. La Volpe. I'm surprised to see you. And why have you appeared at my door? Wait. I know the answer. You always do. You want to put my spies to work? Then join me. In aiding Machiavelli? No, thank you. That man is a traitor to our order. A serious allegation coming from a thief. What is your proof? He was an ambassador to the papal court and traveled as a personal guest of Cesare himself. I also know he abandoned you right before the villa attack. Machiavelli may not please all tastes. But he is an assassin. 
Not a traitor. I am not convinced. Ah. He is meeting someone in the Trastevere right now. Care to accompany me? I will follow. Oh, good. So, apparently, we have a double agent, which is the title of this mission. Double agent, spy on Machiavelli with Volpe and persuade Volpe to rejoin the Brotherhood. Full synchronization, do not be detected while reducing not notoriety. What? Remain undetected until rejoining Volpe and the Thieves Guild. I don't remember this one, apparently, very well. Okay, sure. Great. Great. Now, if I'm not mistaken... Oh, okay, we gotta meet him at the, at the place. Well, so we got something of a, of a story brewing. But unfortunately, we have to end it for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, in the next video, of course, we will go meet up with Lavolpe and see why he thinks that uh, Machiavelli is a traitor to the Assassin's Brotherhood. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like the video, like it. If you want to see more, subscribe. And until next video, I'll see you all later.